Hello and welcome once more to Red Game in Tech. My name is Amata. Today is still the 26th of August and this time I bring you some more binary news regarding a new Age of Empires game which has just been announced by Microsoft by the name of Castle Siege and it's being developed by Smoking Gun Interactive and of course being published by Microsoft Studios and is launching in September for Windows 8 and Windows Phone 8 devices. Now, of course, as I just said, it is coming out for Windows 8 PC, but Castle Siege is apparently built for touch, according to the official blurb. And that's not really going to be making fans of the much-loved PC strategy series exactly enamoured with this title. And the Castle Siege website does say that it offers in-game purchases to accelerate gameplay. Whether or not they'll be present in the PC version, uh, it's hard to say. If it's completely free to play on PC, then yes. If you pay for it, then probably no. Either way, I think Age of Empires fans are kind of getting frustrated at the moment, to be honest. Speaking of gameplay, however, you will be able to build your castle into a city, accumulate resources, and train your armies to defend and attack your enemies. And Microsoft said, quote, Castle Siege is built for you to enjoy the um, expansiveness of Age of Empires game with the speed and simplicity of touch-based gaming. And as you might expect, the touch controls will let you drag past on the screen to command units directly, and conversely on the PC, it'll probably just be mouse-driven, to be honest, and... As with any Microsoft Studios published game, you'll be able to connect to Xbox Live for access to leaderboards, form alliances with your friends, and there will even be a cross-platform play on Windows 8 and Windows 8 phone devices, and your progress will be saved to your gamer tag. Now, we'll be starting with six civilizations from the medieval era, including the Britons, the uh, Teutons, or Totons, or however the balls you pronounce that, and the Kievan Rus. There are ten historical battles, including the Siege of Marienburg and the fall of Constantinople. So there you have it guys, there is also an official trailer which is of course linked in the description below this video if you're curious, but I think a lot of traditional Age of Empires fans have kind of already lost interest the second they heard the words built for touch and then further lost interest when they heard the words microtransactions and to be honest, I don't really blame them. I don't see this being exactly the most popular title ever, I highly doubt it's going to be played by people who actually know and love the Age of Empires franchise, but I could be wrong. Generalising a little bit, I know, but I think a lot of people are just kind of going, no, at the moment. So do let me know if you disagree and you're going to be picking up this title, of course, and I'll see you next time.